Those your puppies. Are those your puppies, girl? Those your puppies? You're a good girl. The question is, is there a super dog or two in this litter of three puppies? That is the question. This big bruiser here. Oh yeah, that's a big bruiser there, Mom. Is that a super dog girl? Whelping box. You can't do it without a whelping box. Here's your little door. That's where she comes in and out. And now we will let nature run its course. Oh, it's snowing out there. Imagine that. This is the girl. Nobody's tentative. They're all assertive. They're all curious. And we're in the market for some super dogs out of this litter. It's a small litter, three, tar three dogs. But strong genes from the mom's side and the dad's side. Strong genetics. We got two boys and a girl. Hold him up so we can see him. Okay. I think they're getting tired now. Think, yeah, they are. They're yeah, they're <laughs> they're ready for a nap. Can you hold him up, the boy? Well, Laz, come here, Laz. Is that him right there? Look at him. And away go. he goes. Look at him go. You do things that are important, like this. Bonding with your puppies. So this darker one is the one that came first on his yeah, own? Yeah, he came out first, you know. These your puppies? Hmm? Oh.
Pine turtle, back. <coughs> nice, nice. Back. Nice. Lazy. Les. Les. Good girl. Yeah, that's a good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Lazy. Les. Les. Good girl. Whoa. 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 Les. Les. Stay. Sit. Sit. Good girl. Okay, let's let the puppies have it. Good girl. Is that your turtle? Is that a big turtle? Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Les, Les. Lesie. Good girl. Good girl. Lazy, Les. Fetch it here. Hey, 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 easy. Whoa. Lazy. Whoa. Easy, gentle. Lazy, come. Good girl. Sit. Good girl. Whoa. Here, puppies. Puppies, look. What's this thing here, puppies? Here, there, somebody sees it. The name of this class is The World is a Stimulating and Wonderful Place Far more interesting than the world inside the cabin That's what this class is Oh, that might be a bit much. That might be a little bit much. Yeah, let's don't try that today. Come on, come on. Lazy. Les. Good girl. Yeah, good girly. Come, come. Come, come. Come on, puppies. Can you imagine? Come on, you monkeys. I can just keep up. That's a mom and that's their grandma with a silver muzzle. She plays with the puppies too.
This actually is three generations of turtle dogs here. And there were others before them. They're very bold puppies, I must say. This is their first interaction with the outside world and they're very bold, look at them. Not the least bit intimidated. It's December 20th, 2019. Oh look, they're eating some snow. Yeah. <laughs> That's kind of rough, Rennie. Don't choke the life out of me. Tell him he's a good boy so he knows what he's that he did the right thing. Yeah. No, go on. You don't need dirt either. Go on. Go on. Don't pay attention what you're doing. I'm not used to people trying to strangle me. <laughs> Red, easy. Easy, Red. Well, now she's raised. Karen, she's raised litters. Oh, little thing's eyes are popping out. I was getting some good movie stuff there. Of, okay, go ahead. Of her Just strangling. Go ahead and choke somebody. Her go granddaughter. Go ahead, kill your one of your children. Go ahead. <laughs> Stop eating dirt. I do sometimes need to clarify things that are not self-evident. And <clears throat> you can see the puppies respond to this spot. It's very special to them. And uh, maybe they have some ancient ancestral uh, wolf gene that recognizes this as the original. Uh, level of oh they're so pretty the way the sun's on there maybe they somehow recognize this as a uh, primordial 
piece of landscape that somehow was never plowed under or taken down for sawmill lumber. But anyway, I uh, just want to clarify that we're here on the very eastern edge of the Rocky Mountains. And if you go just 20 miles further east, you're into the wheat cultivation areas, which go all the way across uh, central Montana, eastern Montana, across all of North Dakota, South Dakota, Iowa, Illinois. But So the agricultural uh, ecological desert starts 20 miles east of here, but here we're on the very edge of the eastern front of the Rockies and you can see it was too steep to plow or else they would have plowed this all under and destroyed it too. But you can see the grass community is completely intact on this hillside. West of the Mississippi there is quite a lot of landscape that is still almost untouched. And uh, the eastern front of the Rockies is such an area. And of course the Rockies all across the western one-third of Montana is pretty much undisturbed. It's all in uh, evergreen coniferous forest. And uh, the west coast, which is to say the coastline of Oregon, Washington, Northern California, which is only served by a little two-lane highway 101, is pretty much pristine, incredibly. Nothing like the east coast where you have cottages and McDonald's and all of the uh, clutter up and down the entire east coast but so uh, the coastline of the Pacific Northwest is relatively intact uh, the high desert country of central and eastern Washington State and Oregon the high desert is still very much intact the uh, Sonoran Desert of Arizona, New Mexico is very much intact. Uh, Utah, very much intact. Look at these magnificent ponderosa pines. I've been waiting for just the right light conditions. Anyway, I did want to show this beautiful, pristine area, old growth ponderosa pine, grass community still completely untouched. Oh, oh boy, there was a fall. Oh. Oh, no, 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 I'm okay. Yeah, see, I fell right there. There's ice, one inch one inch below the ground there, there's ice. Boy. Uh, if you're 72 years old like, like I am, don't try this at home. So. Yeah. Nice. But look at this. Very steep. More than 45 degrees of angle there. Okay. I've said what I wanted to say. Sure, I'll think of other stuff.
and back to the cabin. Lies! Lies!
Raven. Sagebrush. Wild rose hips. Hey, 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 that's far enough. They can't swim. One fell down here. Come. There he is. Okay, wait. Did she come out? Yeah. 
Oh, all good. locked in combat. Less, less, no. That's a serious fight. Okay, you watch the puppies for me. <laughs> it's early February and they're already pairing off and that's courtship fighting. Yeah, they're trying to drown each other. That's no that's no joke. Glass, last, last, stay here. This is the first big snow that the puppies have experienced. Nice, nice. Lazy. Woof! <laughs> 
Got to get some firewood. Oh, thank you. This teared the broom up, why don't we? Good grief. You're not a pit bull. <laughs> well, you just won't turn loose, will you? I could probably pick you up. Okay, thank you. All kinds of little helpers here. Okay, now let's get some firewood. This one. Ooh. How about this one? Woof! Woof! Good boys. Good girls. Come on. Come on.
Evet.
And back to the cabin. Wait a minute. Okay. Come on, come. Wow. You see like you're drowning? <laughs> yeah, there's no track here. They were just bedded down right over there. The deer were? Yeah. Huh. I see the trail. Yep, they're on that deer trail. Is Laz with them? I think she is, yeah. Tail. Come on. There you go. That's why those undocked long tails are so useful. There's enough snow for you, Rennie Rain. Or just enough snow for Rennie Rain. Minky's not gonna like this walk. <laughs> Come on, come, come, no, no.
March 14th, 2020, zero degrees. We were supposed to get two to four inches. We've got probably 15 inches. So just a thought, consider, imagine that all of this snow was uh, grass, foot and a half tall, and we were in Illinois or Michigan hunting for box turtles. Can you understand why I leave the tails long on my turtle dogs? It's so you can find the dogs. Okay, let's go inside. My hands, my fingers are like uh, little icicles right now. Nothing is as wonderful as a cabin in the middle of a snowstorm. Good boys. Hey there, puppies. Come on, pups. Good dogs. Oh, what good dogs. What good dogs. <sighs> that was... Was that the demise of Karen? Yeah. <laughs> they're gonna, they're gonna maul you. Here they come. Yeah. I was gonna do a snow angel, but I couldn't move any snow. <laughs> that was a good one. Hey puppy, you're a good girl. Good dogs. Come on. Come on. Come. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come. 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 This is hard work. Yes, it is. Come on. Come. Come.
Good boy. Come, come. Well, go ahead and take a man, Karen. Hey, come, come, hey, come on out. Okay. It's all going one bowl here. That's how they do it. Let's make some electricity. You gonna help me? Wow. Wow. It's all the game. But what you need as a backup is this, the generator. This is the Onan, built in Wisconsin. 7.5 kilowatt version. Onan electric generator set, built in the 1970s. So it has breaker points, so uh, can't be disabled by a solar flare or an electromagnetic pulse. Here's your battery set. There's eight 
golf cart batteries and it basically you can either build electricity from the running the generator propane generator or you can build electricity with the solar panels when the sun is shining as it just now started to do but I would have to sweep the snow off the solar panels first anyway this is the setup you need eight golf cart batteries then this amazing equipment here inverts this is called an inverter inverts or changes the battery power to household current and sends it right into the cabin. Place, 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 place. Lichen, mustard, lichen, it's not paint. Let's, let's.
Hop, 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 hop. Come on, boy, you can do it. Come. Good boy. Peasant tracks. That's water quality. Good girl. Good girl. 